And so, a legend was born. Welcome to the Beginner's Guide to... Coming from the depths of Atlantis, the legendary shark who conquered the VTuber world, Gaurguda! She may be a shark, but that pales in comparison to the real danger. Just look at her, she's just so goddamn adorable! My heart can barely take it! Ah! This friendly cowboy lover has won many a heart. So much, in fact, that most of her JP Senpai would willingly fight to the death in the Roman Colosseum just to win over her hand in marriage. No, I'm serious. She's really beloved by her JP Senpai. What's that? Can't beat Okayu, you say? She got even the harem master! This can't be possible! All that aside, she's also known for being quite the dummy head. 5 times 5. I would have said 25, but it's 35. Wait. To legendary degrees. Fun fact, in Australia, we only have the grades 1 to 5, and in Germany, they have the grades 1 to 6. Where's the rest of them? Where's 3, 4? 1, one two, 2, 6. 1, one two, 2, 5? <laughs> Good up. 3? Wait, did I mess up? <laughs> oh, yes. She's a shark with a heart of gold, but a head of bone. But you'd be a fool to think of her an idiot, for she's actually quite smart. Just not in the numbers and academics kind. I mean, how else do you think she conquered the VTuber world? It takes more than being cute to do it, and we already got plenty of that. In reality, she's an internet-savvy pro memester. The first thing she ever tweeted was just the letter A, and look how that turned out for her. It's just about one of the most recognizable inside jokes in the entire VTuber community. Besides that, Few are the ones who are able to escape the police. But Gumba over here did it. Everybody! Guilty or innocent! Kawaii no demuzai. Kawaii no Cute and innocent? Gura, you are innocent! <laughs> no way! <laughs> yeah, look out next time, we'll get you next time! You can try! You can try! They can't keep getting away with it. This has to be a crime at some point. She's so aware of her own cuteness, she will weaponize it to great effect. Once she whips out that pro ooze speak that comes out as naturally as Marin being horny, it doesn't matter if she forced you to show toes at gunpoint. She will be able to get away with anything. Oh, Chad was wrong? Oh no, Chad is the bonehead after all? Oh no! But this is just one of the many languages in the repertoire. Her valley curl is also quite fluent. Oh, yes, what? Tony, give me those cards, girl. <laughs> Ew. Ew. It's like she trained her whole life for this. My daddy's not gonna like what you just did, babe. Oh, oh no, the daddy card! The daddy card. Oh my god, girl, stop. You're so loud. Oh my god. We're not at a... What is this, Coachella? Shut oh my the god. Fuck up right now, oh. shut your mouth. And I'd say she's got the most important Japanese basics down. <laughs> oh, you know what they say. If you're not picking up fights like random encounters in an RPG, then you're not living life to its fullest. <laughs> Only difference being that she can get away with it. Don't actually be mad. You can't be mad at me. I'm cute. And she's goddamn right. Feet. Did somebody say feet? It really wouldn't be a good a guide without mentioning it. Let's not forget she and Rene made a foot review stream. <laughs> We're approaching Hachama levels here, everyone. You don't become such a big internet figure without at least having a bit of a degenerate, I mean, cultured side, you know. And there's no point denying it, Goomba. Someone already made an entire 40 plus minutes long compilation of you talking about feet. And then he did it again. And again. This time even longer. Haha, <laughs> that's what I call being caught in 4K. Your, with your day-to-day -day life, stop giving a damn. Just, just stop. Just who cares? Just every day, have fun. Have fun in the way that you want to have fun. And don't care what anybody else says or thinks. Because you're living for you and not for anybody else. That's my life advice. Atta girl, Goob. Rejoice and embrace what you love. Ah! 
as streamers usually do, Kuro plays a wide variety of games in her channel, to very amusing levels of success. And I must say, they truly have allowed her to blow up. Hi. Ah yes, the early Minecraft streams were prime good at Jinx moments. <gasps> this is so sad. This is check. Uh, 360. Pain pickle! But though her numerous failures are quite hilarious, her Minecraft streams are a testament to her tenacity as she pushed through her misfortune and learned her way around the game. Though in the process she may have developed mouth PTSD from every time a certain bunny girl is involved. Boo Boo Bunny! Kawaii! Kawaii! And cute, cute and scary. And while she may have had plenty of dumb shark moments, she's proven to be quite deadly in Among Us. Oh yes, the sharks melt blood in the water. Yeah. <laughs> But as a result, she's one of those members that are instantly seen as sus in every game. Good job, Goober. So, everyone. What up? How do we feel now? Now I'm the same as Goober. That's alright. That's fine. Goober will remember this. Still, tenacity in the face of hardship is one of Goober's greatest qualities, of which one can easily observe. Those Ring Fit Adventure streams, man. Whew, her stamina is honestly quite impressive. <laughs> Uh, wait, YouTube Kun, I can explain! And Slippy! Kura, you're not it's helping slippy. my case here. But few are the things that come close to the sheer awesomeness she puts on display when playing her preferred genre. Witness the majesty of the shark in a natural habitat! Gracefully swimming in an ocean of music! Kura is a rhythm gamer, and man did she impress everyone when she played News Nash on stream for the first time! In fact, she dominates any rhythm game she chooses to play and is probably one of the best, if not the best, rhythm gamer in the entirety of Hololive. Rhythm games can honestly get pretty hardcore, so it takes some real tenacity to get as good as she is. And while we're on the topic of video games, there is another where she built up a legend thanks to her incredible tenacity. Mario Kart! In 2022, Gura was a newcomer to the Holo New Year Cup, Hololive's very heated annual Mario Kart competition. Thus, when Gura was sorted into the Holo New Year Cup infamous 2022 Group B, many assumed she would not survive and make it to the finals. This group was known to be the toughest and most feared group in the whole tournament, and with good reason. Only the top three competitors within the group could move to the finals, and here, in Group B, you would find truly dreadful opposition. Tokoyami Toa, the Speed Demon, former champion Minato Aqua, the Zero Overlord, and champion Hoshimachi Suisei, the Azure Flash Comet. Suffice to say, her chances were not looking good. It seemed that fate had in store for her to be crushed by racing legends of tournaments past. Gura herself did not believe she could do it. But in spite believing her doom was inevitable, Gura practiced really hard. And I cannot stress enough how hard Gura practiced all the way until the day of the tournament. It felt as if she was following in the very same footsteps our bright Azure Flash Comet once took. Even still, when the fated day arrived, Gura believed herself doomed. But deep down, a faint hope remained. Mama Shark raised no quitter, regardless of the outcome, she would give it her all. The final race of the preliminaries was about to begin. Kura had performed admirably well so far, but now she found herself tied in third with a veteran competitor and part-time genius villain, Usada Pekora. Whoever placed higher among the two in this final race would move on to the finals. It was a truly intense showdown. Kura had an amazing start, but messed up and dropped quite hard. Yet, Kura's tenacity shone true. She kept her cool, fiercely making her way back to the top. Things were looking good, but as she was entering the final lap, Pekura hit her with a shell, swiftly passing ahead of her. And here their duel truly hit its climax. Kura tailed Pekura in a fiercely heated pursuit, with Pekura not allowing Kura to take the lead. As the two neared the finish line, Pekura's defenses cracked as the nervousness caught up to her, allowing for Kura to use the opportunity and gain the lead right before the end. And so, just like that, Kura had done it. Holy shit, I did it? <laughs> Do you see this? <gasps> Ian, are you still practicing? Do you see it? Do you see it? Connie! Tana! Holy cow! 
couldn't survive the infamous 2022 Group B and was thus able to make it to the finals, where she would compete with the best of the best in Hololive. In the end, Gura achieved a very respectable 4th place, an outstandingly amazing feat! Hololive members take Mario Kart very seriously, and there are absolute living storms in it, and to make it to 4th place as a newcomer no less, above many experienced and skilled veterans, is truly worthy of song and legend! She is who swims against the current, the tenacious force which rebels against her own fate. Thus, I shall name her the Cerulean Riptide, Gaur Gura. Though in the 2023 Cup she wasn't at her best, I shall never forget her legend. Within this small shark rests a tenacious warrior strong enough to overturn fate itself. Who doesn't love a good singer? And singing is yet another way Gura won the hearts of many, all the way since the moment she sang right on time back in her debut stream. And with no exaggeration, Gura is an absolutely outstanding singer. Her karaoke streams are always a delight to listen. And let me tell you, her 3D concert was amazing, especially her jazz rendition of Reflect. Which brings me to my next point. Song recommendations! Woo! Reflect is Gura's first original song, and oh boy, was it wonderful! I couldn't stop listening to it for days in a row. Most people were expecting a cute pop song, but instead we got a serious song exploring different sides of Gura's self. It's amazing! Her cover of Target for Love is sweet and relaxing, playing very well to the strengths of Gura's cute voice. Perfect for chilling. And then Q. A collab original song between Gura and Kali. A truly amazing banger combining Kali's coolness with Gura's cuteness. I love smug Gura. Surprisingly enough, Gura doesn't actually upload that much music, at least compared to the other amazing singers in Hololive. But I guess that makes her karaoke streams all the more special. Ah, wait just a damn minute, you're forgetting about the other one! Ah, but of course! Meet Red Gura. It's Gura, but she's edgy. Fire Emblem logic dictates that if you're a red unit, that means you're evil. She is the Gaur in Gaur Gura, and she was first introduced in the song Reflect. And she's considerably more savage than the nice cute Gura that we know. I mean, she's still cute, but this one definitely bites. She doesn't come out often, but when she does, it's always a treat. Holy shit, she sunk Sabaton? Deus Volt! Deus Volt! A friendly shark with a cleverness to rise to the top, who endeared the hearts of millions. Indeed, it took Gura only 37 days for her to achieve 1 million subscribers. The first of many in whole life to do so, and at the time of these videos making, she is well into the 4 million mark, the largest number among traditional VTubers. But though I may talk of numbers, one does not need to see them to understand Gura's greatness. You'll also find that Gura is surprisingly wise. I must reiterate, she may have very boneheaded moments, but do not think of her as a fool, or you will be surprised by her mind more often than you'd think. Her fellow genmate Mori Calliope has even expressed multiple times that Gura is one of the smartest people she's ever met. And if I may add on top of that, I see in Gura the tenacious and valorous spirit of a warrior. Tenacious. I have used this word to describe Gura multiple times in this video, a quality you can observe in many of the legends of the VTuber world. Indeed, for it is with no exaggeration that I consider Gura to be worthy of the title of VTuber legend, up there in the starry sky of legends. What the future will hold, I know not. But suffice to say, she is the face of an entire era of VTubing history. A legend which many thousands of VTubers look up and aspire to become. Standing at the peak, together with their genmates, she inspired an entire worldwide phenomenon that has carved itself in the history of online entertainment. Gura may have never desired nor expected such an outcome, but she has nonetheless achieved this plateau with her many talents and charms, impacting the industry since day one. From a very nervous and shy tiny girl to becoming one of the shiniest jewels of the vast ocean that is the VTuber industry, this is Gaur Gura, a VTuber who charmed the world. Ah, domo same desu! Thank you for watching! Consider biting the subscribe button and leave a uvu in the comments. Otsusame!